welcome to our third video. Um, we are going to be drawing fries, a burger, and a pop today. So let's get on with the video. So first what you're going to want to do is in the center we're going to draw the burger. So you're going to want to do a straight line. As big as you want, but I'm just going to do it like a medium size. And then you're going to want to start up here and do like a big curve for the bun. And then we're going to start with the, let's just say, the meat part. So you're going to want to do, actually let's make that a tomato right there. That will be the tomato. Then we will do the cheese, which will start the same way, a little curve. But except as you're going, you're going to want to do like a little triangle in it so it looks like a piece of cheese. So we're going to do it like that. Like we're going to have it keep on going and then curve back up there. Okay? And we kind of want those pieces to be even. So we're going to just do that a little bit so it looks like that. And then now comes the meat. Um, we're going to do a big round this time. This is the biggest one of all of them. And then we're going to have it like that. We're going to have to make that even too again. So there's our like toppings on our burger. Now we're going to draw the bottom bun. Let's make that just a little bit more even. Okay, that's how it is. Now I'm going to draw the bun, the bottom bun. I'm going to do like a line-ish, just kind of tracing the same way of the um, meat. But then I'm going to, this should be a little bit longer than everything else. I'm going to do a little curve, but then a little straightness too. So then I'm going to go down and do that. So they're all attached. So that is your burger. That. Um, so there's your burger. Now let's get started on the fries. So we will do the like the container of the fries after we do the fries so first we're going to do like one sticking up you can make them any size you can make them have funky faces if you wanted to but we're just going to have regular fries and then a little bit cl a little closer to it like right there we're going to do another fry you can be tall it can be smaller which i'm just going to make mine taller like that and then they kind of look like a stack of buildings honestly and then you could do one like a little bit smaller like that and you could really do whatever you want and then if you want one behind you could make it like right there if you want to like that see how I made that kind of behind it that's kind of a little thick fry. So I'll just make that a little bit smaller, okay? And then we can make one like over here, a bigger one. No fries are really the same size. There can be many fries that are the same size, but I'm just gonna make mine all different. And then we're gonna have a little curved one, like that. And then we're gonna put one right here to look like it's coming up. Okay, so those are my fries that I'm going to do. And now I'm going to make the container. So by the container, you're going to start by making like a shortish line. And then you're going to see how I made that line. And then you're going to dip in. So it's going to dip in like that. So you have it like that. And then you're going to do another line like that. Okay. And then you're going to make it like a big line. And if you wanted to, which I'm going to do, is I'm just going to erase the top and I'm going to make it a little bit closer to the fries so the fries just don't look like they're floating. So I'm going to do it like that. And if you want to, you can make them longer so they can like fit in the container. Like, see how I'm doing that? So like that. But then I'm probably going to make more over here because it's kind of empty over there. So let's just make one like 
at the end we can make one like look like it's flying over here and one up there like that and then you can draw some over there if you would you don't have to do this you can if you really wanted to you could keep them all in the middle if you wanted to but then I'm gonna make one like flying a little bit and then I'm gonna make one really tall so there those are my fries and then if you want to, you can make a little design right there, which I'm just going to do this. I'm just going to make two lines that are about like even like that. And then I'm going to do, I'm going to go a little bit, I'm going to do like a circle right there. So you guys can see how I did that, just a circle. And then I'm going to do like one, some lines in there so it doesn't look like it's just on one side. And then in that circle, you're going to do another smaller circle in there, if you want to. Okay, so those are your fries and your burgers. Now it's time to do the pop. So, to start the pop, we're going to do it probably over here. And you're going to want to do, like, you're going to want it coming, like, right there. You guys can see that. Then you're going to, from down there, you're going to want to do a line. And then you're going to have it going up. So that's your shape of your pop, okay? So then you're going to make like a line there. Like that. So that's the shape of your pop. And then a little bit longer out there, like probably like right there, you're going to want to do like a big curved line. So say I'm right there, I'm going to want to do like a straight line but kind of curved. And then I'm going to do that from this side, too. But I'm going to have that coming down a little bit more from the hair. And then I'm going to have that coming from there and doing the thing. So there is the pop. And then you need to draw a straw if you would like. So then I'm just going to draw a straw coming from it. If you just do those two lines. And then you can do like a little curved. And that is your straw. And then if you would like to do a design on there, on the cup, like I did on the fries, then you are more than welcome to. I'm just going to do like a stripe. So that's my drawing of the... <laughs> things and I guess I kind of made the theme of my um food red and yellow because yeah most of them are red and yellow and I hope you guys like and subscribe uh, so thank you for watching bye mm -hmm.